Brighton now set to sign James Milner. The final proposal and all the clauses have been accepted. The deal will be valid until June 2024. Mm. Milner will join Brighton on a free. Mm. What a what a career Milner has had. He's probably the, arguably the best pro I've ever worked with. <laughs> and that's really? What, yeah. That's yeah. what Suna said. His level of professionalism blows everybody away. He's, he's magnificent to work with. Um, and you get value for money. You get games with him, the, the amount of games he's but played. You get a great character. I mean, soon as on this exactly, award winning podcast, that I'm doing everything. Said. Sorry, Stuart was talking there, and I was glad he was talking over you. What were you talking about? Your, your own award winning podcast. podcast. I think you'll find I was talking under him because yes. he talked over me. He true, did, but Stuart. It's not very annoying. Sorry, you were saying to that uh, said little this, listen to podcast. Soon as said the same thing. That the, if, one of the conversations was about leaders and he went and the first leader he picked out was James Milner mm. he said I'd have him every day of the week in any team that I managed and have him everywhere of course there's a link isn't there we've got Lalana playing for mm. Brighton that would have given James I suspect but they'll get a decent they do this don't they they get good senior mm. pros to go in amongst the mix but again here we are talking about Brighton player being indexed to a purported bigger club in Alexis McAllister yeah, these are the things no, I talk true. about. Uh, you told us, yeah, and you stand by that. Is the best pro that yeah. you've worked with? Yeah, I, I, I said a few years ago, pound for pound, he's been, and people would say, "Oh, you're crazy." Different players, and they threw other names. Pound for pound, what you get? They talk about this in boxing. Pound for pound, he is the best player in the Premier League there's ever been. I, I, and I'd stick by that for what you get, what he gives you around the training camp, the games that he plays. Everything that, that he stands for, all of those things, you put that in a computer and his name would come out one of the top ones. Best player in the Premier League? Yeah. Not best as in ability-wise. I'm talking about everything that a, a modern-day player should give in you. In terms of what he gives you? Yeah, for professionalism, how he conducts himself. I've never seen a, a bad word in newsprint about James Milner, you know, leading a lifestyle that he shouldn't or anything of that nature. He's the record caps holder for the under 21s. He's an England into. I didn't think he'd get an England senior cap when I had him at the under 21 level. I thought he was a good player, but I weren't sure where he'd seal him out. He, he went on to get, I think, 47 caps or something of that nature. Um, he's won the, won the league with Liverpool. He's won the league with Manchester City. He's just an incredible individual so, to work so with. So, what are Brighton getting in a player who's 37? Well, we talk about leadership being in such a, a, a sparse commodity this day and age. You get leadership. I think Liverpool have been really fortunate because they've got Henderson and Milner in their dressing rooms. And if you if you want to know what they're like as individuals, go and ask Klopp about how they conduct themselves, you know, and um, probably how they guide others in and around them. And Mil Milner's just... Magnificent for me, you know. Okay, you've got a great penalty taker as well. You know, you're going to score a penalty when it's on the spot with Milner. It's amazing, Bright Brighton. Just go about it quietly, effectively. The time at home is by the sea. Jim White and Simon Jordan, Monday to Friday mornings from ten on AM on DAB via the Talksport app and on your smart speaker. Talksport.